Senator Derek Schmidt. Uh, he is, was the principal Senate sponsor of Jessica's Law, which imposes life prison terms on violent sex offenders who prey on children. He helped secure the passage of the Johnson County Research Triangle legislation, and his work to improve the business climate in Kansas was recognized with the Guardian of Small Business Award from the Kansas chapter of the National Federation of Independent Businesses. He is a graduate of Independence High School. He studied at Independence Community College, earned his bachelor's degree in journalism. Yeah, this is the guy in, in journalism. Um, from the University of Kansas and his master's degree in international politics from the University of Leicester in the United Kingdom. He resides in Independence. He and his wife, Jennifer, are the parents of two young daughters, Senator Derek Schmidt. Thank you very You're much. You're welcome. <laughs> well, thank you. I, uh, I wanted to make sure you heard it twice for name ID purposes. Uh, <laughs> on the power of government, that there are many things that are wonderful and good, but that ought to be done by people and not by public organizations, uh, are at a point where that discussion matters in our nation's history. A lot of us have looked at the direction of change that has been coming from the Potomac since last year's election. And I don't know if you share this view, but I believe that the kind of change we're seeing is not the kind of change that most Americans, or at least in this part of the country, thought they were getting. I, at the end of the day, the votes are there in the U.S. House and the U.S. Senate and the White House, the President's pen to do things that many of us would find contrary to our view of what this country ought to do and what it ought to be. But the votes are there. Our job over the course of the next months and years is to engage in the conversation that you all have started, to broaden that conversation to include more and more voices, to be sure that we are making the points that we think ought to be our side of the choice that's presented to America they get to vote for change and to give them the kind of change that many of us believe is the direction this country ought to be headed. Thank you.